Hello everybody. In this video, we're going to talk about Python Wajin and especially how to make your perfect Wajin practice. We're going to focus on the weights that we put on our ankles and we're going to discuss how much is the best amount of weights. How I discovered this for myself and what I truly think. Of course, we can end this video with Q&A um, if there are enough, uh, enough uh, people watching this during the live. Okay, Woo. I just woke up. Um, so, what, uh, why we should use waist, uh, weights and should we use weights? This is the question in my opinion because I think that Practicing by the Wajin, uh, I mean only Wajin, is not like uh, the more the better. You see this logic of uh, Winnie the Pooh. So <clears throat> practicing Wajin without weights is not less, is not beginner. Uh, and practicing Wajin with a lot of weights is not something that makes you advanced practitioner. Uh, and I realized this with my practice. I practice uh, from around five years, around five years, maybe plus minus three months. So <laughs> when I started, I thought like this, like I will start without weights and then we'll gain uh, the kilos. So I started without weights and the results was there. And uh, after a few months, let's say three, four months, I bought myself some weights, put four kilos uh, at, uh, in the beginning too, because I had two bags with two kilos. Hi, Justin. Uh, and I put one, started to practice with two kilos. After a week, I increased with four kilos and I stayed with four kilos uh, for two, three months, maybe two. More, more like two. And then I bought uh, two bags with three kilos uh, and start to use, start to practice it, start to practice with six kilos. And till that time, everything was fine. It's like um, I didn't uh, feel that I used too much weights on my leg. And my improvements uh, were continuing to happen, like the benefits, I enjoyed them. And uh, then I increased to 10 kilos. Uh, hello, Michael. Wow, all of you guys are here. Thank you for watching this live. So I increased to 10 kilos. Uh, and I, in the beginning, I enjoyed it. I felt like the, that the stretching is more. And I practiced like this for, uh, with uh, 10 kilos, six to 10 kilos every day. We, like I didn't practice without weights on my ankle. And I continued my practice a very long time like this. Maybe, maybe a year or two. I mean, I practiced a lot. And then I, one practice, wanted to add some more because I heard uh, <laughs> that a guy practiced with 20 kilos and I still not sure to this day if this guy is practicing with 10 kilos that uh, uh, 20 kilos that he put all on the hanging leg because some people uh, they also put weight on the top leg that is uh, on the bench like like this and they put it here uh, to, to stretch the calves more and anyways i tried with as much as i can and i tried with 15 15 kilos and i realized that for my shoulders was kind of better to practice more like it was the, the stretching uh went way up to the to the upper parts of the body more than without weights but there is one thing that I pretty much enjoy and I lost it since I, I started 
to, to practice with weights. And I realized it later. This is like super comfortable getting into squatting position because Lagin makes my ligament soft, long. And uh, you see, like if I'm in this position, like standing position, I, I, I squat like without thinking, without thinking for my knees, without thinking for my ankles. And this was, um, and, and I realized that I lost this, this sensation. Uh, and, and in my opinion, this is very important. I lost this since I started to practice uh, with 10 kilos. Uh, and with 15 kilos, uh, it was still lost, of course. And as uh, something that I can have all this information and synthesize it uh, right now, after all these years, I think that practicing with uh, without weights is something really cool it's not less than practicing with weights uh, you can use the weights depends on what you want from your legend practice um, depends on you see if I want to 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 feel comfortable I practice with with little weights or without weights right now and if I want to the stretching to go deep to my body and to have this effect on flexibility because when I practiced with 15 kilos and more, uh, the there was obvious improvement on my flexibility. So sometimes I want to improve a little bit my flexibility just because of dancing. Uh, and uh, but, but I easily gave up of this idea because I see that the healthy point is something the, the healthy area is some somewhere in the in the middle like from without weights to five six kilos uh on the ankle at least is it it is like this for me but i believe that it's like that for for every human being because in my girlfriend is is the same so she she does not like it to to practice with a lot of weights. Many of my uh, students say the, say the same. Uh, it has this dangerous feeling if you put too much weights. Uh, but yeah, it, it, you have this dangerous feeling if you just practice spida or or just stretching for a lot of a lot of um, time. So yeah, S T. Been 1.5 months since I'm practicing Lajin. Good for you, man. Good for you. Uh, I have a question for you now here live. Do you start to feel improvement in the comfort? Uh, but can you tell me what time you are talking about? I, I can see that you, you are saying my time is increased from 20 seconds to 3 minutes. Uh, I mean, you lay this much on the bench. Uh, or you talk about the other time that the, the other aspect of, of the things, I mean, the sexual aspect, uh, because this channel is, you know, it's made for mostly for sexual problems and by the way, but it's like 80% sexual problems, 20% by the way, Michael Seno foam. I think the more weights on the lower leg, the more the front meridian of the stomach opens up. Michael, you are totally right. You are totally right. Uh, but in the same time, uh, like it's like right here, it's also stretches here, and I feel it also stretching here. So it's not only the stomach, but I mean the weights is really like uh, extending the the stomach meridian because it's right here in the middle. But yeah, you, you are totally right. I hope to, to, to see an uh, answer from ST about my question. I mean, ST, you talk about time in bed or you talk about time in how much you lay on the bench. I hope you are still online, man. Because I'm really, really interested in this thing. Uh, sometimes you can, you can just email me. You can just uh, go to my email and if you want to say your improvement, 
or that you don't have improvement, you can just talk with me. I'm here for you guys. So yeah, um, it, it adds stretching in, in the stomach. It... Oh, very good. So we have live some guy <laughs> that see, that is sharing his improvement life. This, this is never happening. And I'm super happy <laughs> you can see uh, the happy look on my face. Very good, man. Very good. I wish you to, to reach even more minutes, uh, not only on the bench, not only on the bench, but on in, in bed. This is very good. I'm super happy for you. Super, super happy. You see, th this guy is going through things that I I was going. Um, when I started, I practiced. I've practiced only with gym, and I can say that my improvement happened with the same speed. Like in the first month and a half, I started to experience some increasing like this. Uh, I this this is one one thing I should uh, tell you, man. That it is when you start practicing, start to notice the the benefits. The first year of practice, you go many times uh, to ups and downs in the effect, uh, but. Just stay motivated. This is my uh, advice to you. Just, just stay motivated and continue your practice because I know from experience that this thing will stop. Like the ups and downs stop sooner or later. In, in my case, it happened in the third year. Um, but really the first year was with very big ups and downs. It's like when I just walk a little bit on the coat Weather, uh, I lost my a, a lot a lot of my improvement. If I stayed warm in the summer, I I lasted longer. So yeah, cool, very cool, very cool, very 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 cool. Uh, you made my day. So let's go back to a gym. The the other thing that I wanted to say is like if you practice with weights, you want only by improving the amount of by increasing the amount of weights to reach more uh, more benefits in less time spending on the bench not a good strategy in my opinion the time you spend on the bench is important really really important um, yeah it's like seven minutes with 10 kilos on on the hanging leg is not equal to 20 minutes without weights. 20 minutes without weights stretching on the bench is way more than this. So combining both of it, perfect. But it's like the, the time you spend on the bench, the time you spend stretching is way more important than this. So, okay, I will focus on the chat now this was all i wanted to, to say in this video i don't want to be, to be too long because i have a new question very good question how about using a massage table as login bench perfect why not um you can you're probably doing it the same like uh you place your massage bench near some end of, of the wall and you just lift the top leg uh, the other leg is hanging then move the the bench a little bit uh, the the massage table a little bit and do the opposite so it's it's perfect i use mine uh, sometimes uh, i use it for neck watching uh, because it's very very uh, it's way more easier to practice the neck watching uh, with your massage bench because it's longer you see it's good that you have a massage bench massage benches are good because they are not too soft they have this soft uh, foam surface but they are not like too soft so perfect just uh, the all massage uh, tables have this hole to put your face in just practice it from the other way because in in this if you're Lower back is placing on this uh, on this hole. It can 
like move your pelvis from one and other direction so it can be like super correct position but i'm sure that you are doing it from the other end <laughs> yeah so yeah guys you made my day i'm super happy about that long time no see i was on vacation and spending very good time on the black sea here in bulgaria that's why I've, I, I was missing from YouTube. Thank you so much, guys. We'll miss you. Uh, and stay tuned. I will upload a few more videos. They will be like for, for more for the masses uh, because I'll upload practices like uh, pelvic floor exercises, uh, pelvic floor routines, stuff like that people are more interested in just because I need more views to reach more people, to spread my other techniques uh, like Pida and Wajin. Uh, my, they are not mine. I said mine. They are, they are the whole world. But yeah, I, I use the word mine because we're practicing it here. Yeah. So anyways, I will upload a few clickbait videos. Don't uh, judge me. But they will be good. I mean, they will be quick, clickbait videos. But they will be good. But still, my personal practice will remain Pidawajin and a little bit of meditation techniques from yoga. So, yeah, I need this channel to grow. Uh, many people actually start from my clickbait videos and move to my discussions. And this is pure gift. So everyone notice the result when it starts to practice a lot Pidawajin. Uh, oh, I, we have uh, one more question. Johan, first of all, thank you, man. Um, ST, I can now feel the blockages where were in hips, knee joints, and calves. ST, you are a very smart man. You are a very smart man. These are very key places that sexual energy is, is going through, you see. By sexual energy, I mean the energy of the kidneys, the liver, the stomach more or less like the stomach is not that uh, related but kidney urinary bladder um, liver and gallbladder but stomach and spleen too stomach and spleen too so yeah these are th these are the areas that these are going and in the same time if if you think about that like the hips hips man so many so many blood um so many blood vessels so many nerves need to go through hips to supply with blood this this area these muscles that are all around the pelvis uh, because if these muscles are tight if they are short if that's uh, th these muscles have inflammation because of poor blood supply poor poor nerve supply um this is the, the this will be a place that disease will get bigger and bigger but if you stretch uh if you release these areas regularly i'm sure that if you stop your practice uh they will they will begin to to inflammate again these muscles because we the western people more the western people uh we sit on high chairs, on couches, uh, and this area is very, very vulnerable to this way of life. So we never stretch this area for nothing, you see. And the muscles are very big and they became even bigger. They, they sore like, um, and, and they compress all the things in the pelvis. So if we stretch them, uh, if we add comfort to pelvis, uh, it's very logical to have improvement in sexual uh, in our sex life. Tight muscles of lower body, especially in glutes and hamstrings. Yeah, and Lajin is a very good way to, to unblock these things because it's passive. You can lay a lot. It's not harmful. Uh, it is uh, stretching not only these areas because you can... Uh, you can uh, unblock your glutes and other muscles in, in the pelvis with the other parts that Wajin stretching is stretch, 
uh, it, well, that Virginia is stretching. It's like the ankle is stretched and he adds, he is doing his role in relaxing the pelvis, believe me. India, good, very good. Sorry, I said Western people. I have, I have many subscribers from India, but um, I, I said that because in India, people are usually more flexible than, than Europeans. That's why I said it. <clears throat> because I'm a break dancer too, and when I watch break dancers from India, they're way more flexible than, than break dancers in Bulgaria. But this is another uh, another proof that you can be flexible and blocked in the same time. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much. And again, ST, uh, I wish you all good. Continue your practice. What is a good height for a Lajin bench? I'm 185. Uh, uh, just a second, please. A good height. Uh, you can check the height by... Look, take, take something that that is high. And when you just uh, sit on this thing, your 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 legs are hanging. You see something like something like how to say it, something like this. 